All right, everybody. How's everybody doing this evening? It's uh, hey Johnny. Uh, so it's uh, it's Friday evening. Uh, tomorrow, get on an airplane to go to Dubai. Uh, today's Jody's birthday. So, Happy birthday, Jody. Um, so to celebrate Jody's birthday, I'm going to do an unboxing video. I uh, feel like that's just appropriate just to uh, you know, make sure that I get my fair share of love on Jody's special day. Uh, so anyways, uh, thanks so much for your generosity, guys. These, these videos are always very special to me when, uh, you know, it's just crazy. You guys are unbelievable. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, and Johnny's over, so I'm like, well, let's just see what we got. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so let's just start ripping through these. Uh, okay, uh, this one is from Zachary Wyman. Okay, let's see, Zachary, what we got. And yeah, so like tomorrow on the plane, um, yeah, so uh, everything is, is finished. Well, pretty much everything's finished. Um, yeah, it won't be long before the big fight now. Wanted to do this before, you know, just in case there was some special tool to help destroy Levon. I got it. Alright, okay. There we go. Is that easy? What do we got here? What do we have? Looks like some kind of mouse. What oh, this t-shirt. Nice. Okay, well, let me see. We'll do like a reveal so everybody sees it at the same time. Oh! Oh, oh, oh yeah! Nice. That is kick ass! That is nice. Kick ass! Man, what a cool shirt is that! Hey? Zachary. Zach. I'd say you nailed that one, buddy. That is a strong shirt if ever I've seen one. Hey, death riding a pussycat. I like it. Well, I gotta wear this one, right? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, doggy. Mm -hmm. We got a good one to start with. Well, I'd say that's a strong start to the old unboxing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Call this, uh, what would you say? Round three? No. Two. Two. Yeah. Round two. Could be. Yeah. Could be. I think so. All right. Thank you, brother. Super cool. Super, super cool. Adam Raider. Adam Raider. Johnny, so what do you think? Did I get like freaking massive in this? What do you think? I don't know if you're big enough. We were just discussing measurements earlier. Jody was being pretty nice to me, eh? <laughs> well, talking about measurements. <laughs> yeah. Uh huh. Man, people are so good to me. Cards. Sir. Maple syrup. Beautiful. Man, you cannot go wrong. You cannot go wrong. Last little shots before I before I get over there. Adam, enjoy your gift. That's amazing. Thanks so much, brother. I actually was just starting to run low on maple syrup. I'm down on my last bottle, so. Incredible. And uh, I'll have some cards to play on the plane. So cool. So very cool. Yeah, Jody was being really mean to me today. Did you notice that? I thought you said she was being nice to you. Well, I was being sarcastic. Oh. Yeah. Did you notice that? Like, yeah. It was her birthday. I know. Yeah, so you said she was allowed to on her birthday. Did remember I say that? No, I don't remember saying that. Yeah, you said she was allowed to be mean to me because it was her birthday. I don't know if I said that. Do you think that that would hold up in court? 
Like, you you assaulted that man. It was my birthday. Probably. Do you think it would hold up anywhere? Like in kindergarten? Yes. Like, you think you get freebies in kindergarten? Yes. Where do the freebies stop? Oh, I, I have no idea. They definitely stop, though. I know that. Like, do you think it's fair for Joey to be so mean to me on her birthday? Yeah. Okay. Okay, we'll leave that alone now. All right, so we got one. It's it's wrapped in two. Let's see what this one is. I guess it's from the same person. Doesn't say who's from here. Oh, joint care. Joint care. I think when I get done from this trip, I'm going to need a lot of joint care. Probably. Yeah. This has everything I can think of for joints and tendons. I don't know if you take collagen. Yes. Fish oil. Yes. Or any multivitamins. Yes. Thanks a lot to you guys. Um, but they could help you. Also, have you ever heard of Wim Hof? Yes. Oh, Daniel Scarcella. Dude, you haven't you already gotten any vitamins? I feel like you give me so much stuff. Um, yeah, Wim Hof. I, I love that dude. He's brilliant. Um, the stuff that that guy has done, completely insane. And then he teaches it to other people too. That's even crazy. It's not like he's just special. No, no, make him wait. Good. The five minutes, right? Yeah. yeah. Um, like, yeah, Wim Hof. I, I do a little bit of Wim Hof stuff before. You use some of his breathing techniques? Yeah, before I compete. Yeah. Yeah. Because I think that, uh, like, the body. Make him wait. I, get, Daddy. Get. Get. Um, I think the body's a little bit like a gas tank. And you normally sit at like half or third, an eighth. Okay. Or on E. Sure. You know. <laughs> the pretty well anywhere. Anyway, you sit all over the place. But uh -huh. if you want to get on full and even super full when you supercharge I like to supercharge before uh, I'm supposed to take these where were you going with that well I do it before I do Wim Hof before uh, I compete on a full tank oh yeah yeah I go in full like before I compete I'll like I'll breathe I'll hyperventilate for like 20 minutes till I'm like buzzing yeah and then I'll normally come down a bit, so I'm not going to, like, you know, like, yeah. No one? Nah, I'm full. It's full. Insane. You walk around like that? Full? Yeah. I have been lately. Hey, speaking of full, do you know who I'm going to get into arm wrestling? No. Cry Cole's Grizzly. That'd be cool. Yeah. That guy has a destiny. That guy's gonna become an arm wrestler. I'll tell you right now. I see arm wrestler all over that guy. Imagine him versus the crippler. That'd be that'd be the one to make, right? Straight away. Straight away, right? Yeah. You think? No. Don't give him the crippler for right away. Give him like uh, Arden. Who? Arden. Who? Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. Somebody, you know, not you can't give him. Get your bottom make material. Yeah. Arm has a match come on. Be I just saw him drinking on Uncle John's show. Arm was looking huge. He said he was 190. Maybe 185. Looking, looking big. Okay, so I'm guessing this is from Daniel also. Oh, actually, no. This is from Daniel Blackwood. But I'm guessing, because they were wrapped up, that Daniel Scarcella is maybe Daniel Blackwood. I don't know. Maybe they're not supposed to reveal that. Sorry. Uh, anyways. Oh. What do we got here? We got some flags. Oh, wow. We got some flags. I love flags. I do like flags. Especially when the right person's in charge. I like the flag a whole lot better when that's the case. It'll leave that one. <laughs> yeah. It'll leave that one. Oh, I like it. That is cool. I like it a lot. I like wow. it a lot. That's beautiful. Yeah, that's awesome. That's a beautiful flag right there. Love it. 
Love that flag. I'll hang that up somewhere. I love it. And, um, you know, always uh, felt an extremely close brotherhood to USA. Brotherhood, family, you know. Yeah, I feel like, you know, you cross that board, it's... I feel like it's the same country. I mean, I, I, I always used to hear, oh, there's a big difference between Canada and the USA. I don't think there is. Do you think there is? I mean, right now there is. Right now there is. Right now there is. But the people, no. <laughs> Governments, yes. No, it's really close. Yeah. Yeah, it's really close. And I've got, like, I feel like, you know, if it wasn't for USA, I wouldn't have done a lot of work, you know, back when I was actually working. Like, I feel like everything we did, we did with the, with the Americans. So, yeah. Well, thank I, I really like that flag. Super cool. And I feel like, you know, especially right now, like, I really feel like, like I'm going to fight uh, East, you know, it's, it is, it is East, it's King of the Table, but this is a East versus West. And I feel like it's not just for Canada, you know, I'm stepping up for the entire Western Hemisphere. I feel like that's the truth. Yeah. Yeah. No pressure. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. All right. Okay. Oh. Oh. I know what this is. You're so good at this. I know what they, well, I know what, some of them I know what they are. So this is from Marcus Tedesco. Okay, I'm pretty sure that this is the dude. I call him inside outside dog. This is the dude when I was in uh, Texas. Uh, when I was in Texas, I went to this bar and it was like, one of the most awesome practices that I ever went to. I walked into this bar and I swear it was like 150 people like to arm wrestle. Like arm wrestled all night. Guys brought like donuts and... Make them wait. I... Get in here, doggy. Get in here. Get, get, get. You're training for that. Eh, what? Don't do that again. <laughs> um... So anyways, yeah. went, uh, everybody was so nice to me. This dude came and he had this uh, jerky. And I had like four or five packs of it and yeah. ate some of it, brought it home, ate it. And I was like, stuff is amazing. I went to order it because like, I liked it so much. I went to order it and uh, they didn't ship to Canada. Bastard. Yeah. So I wrote the company. I was like, yo, guys, you think about shipping to Canada. I got some of this stuff when I was in Texas. It's really good. Like, can we? Anyways, and the guys, I think they remembered who I was. And, uh... and I think that they sent me some stuff, man. I think they sent me some stuff. <laughs> Sorry. Is everybody, is everybody okay? Is there, is everybody okay? Is Hold on. <laughs> yeah, everyone's all right. Okay. Yeah. You Guys, nothing, excited. nothing but the best equipment here, okay? Nothing, nothing but the best stuff, okay? I, I misplaced my stand. So now it's a fine balancing act that we're working with. And, uh, okay, I got a little bit excited there, so let's sort this back out. Hey, it was, it was a dog. The dog did something. Don't blame the dog. The dog was bad. Don't blame the dog. No. Yeah. Okay, i got to remember not to do that again. You get excited. <sighs> All right. Oh, okay. Well, look. How can yeah. you not? Right, exactly. How can you not? Look at this stuff. What an input. See this stuff? Okay, so this is, uh, this is not a paid promotion. This is just me straight. I straight up tried to order it. Brave, good, kind, all naturals, no antibiotics. Brave, good, kind. Well, he get away from there. Yeah, he is gonna. Oh, I know. I know. He's gonna have to go outside. Let's see if I got a website on here. Um. See. You can always link it. www. Dot chickenbites.com you won't regret it guys go to the gym 
go to gym. Who am I kidding? Go to arm wrestling practice. 10 grams of protein later. Perfect. 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 Hey? Eh? Tell me that's not a win right there. That's not a win. That's a win. That's a big win. Thanks, buddy. Really appreciate that. I'll bring some of that on the flight tomorrow. Because I haven't packed yet. So I gotta pack. Leaves tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. You know what that is? It looks like a picture. I guess it's a picture. Look. Yeah. So this is from Abby Jenner. Let's see what we got. Look, it's stuck. Damage anything? That was just protective. Okay, okay, I see what's going on. Okay. It's a nice picture drawing. Instagram. Supa underscore dizzle underscore art. Hi Devin. I'm not sure if this will get to you before the big match with Levon. Well there you go. It did. As I'm sending it from UK. If it does, good luck. I'm rooting for you all the way. If it doesn't, I hope you won. But whatever happens, you have a fan and me for life. Awesome. Awesome. So kind. I hope you like the picture. It's watercolor mixed with graffiti. So hopefully you think it's cool. Anyway, stay massive, brother. Dan Jeffrey from London, England. Damn, it's, I, I'm excited already. I have a feeling this is going to be really good. You look all professional with your super dizzle art. Like, I can tell this is not something that you just kind of do. Like, I can tell that this is... Uh, just be careful. Well, I'm just saying. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look at me. Look, I'm being careful. Look at him. Look at all yeah. this cardboard. He's super careful. It's not his first time. No. Okay. Super dizzle art. I can't wait. Super Dizzle Art. I like that paper. I should get something like that for like my stories that I do. Oh, yes. Right? Yeah. Should be on the bestseller list. Oh, yeah. And it's laminated. You can't screw this up. You can't, you can't mess this up. Wow. That looks wicked. Oh, that's man, awesome. That's cool, man. Yeah. Oh, that's, that's awesome. awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you're pretty good. You're pretty good, Dan, I'd say. You got some skills. I love that style. I love that graffiti style. It's, uh, yeah, awesome. I'll, uh, I'll hang it up in my gym. Thanks, brother. Means the world to me. Really love it. Makes uh makes it all worth my while and then some. Super Dizzle Art, guys. Super Dizzle Art. Dan Jeffrey. That's wild, eh? Yeah. Alright. Okay. Not known who this is from. Doesn't say. Doesn't say. Be careful with that. Bam! More power. Curcumin. 95%. Turmeric root extract. That's some good stuff for inflammation. Let's see if oh, this box is going start. Yeah, he's out of control. Yeah. Yeah. Turmeric. Turmericcurcumin.com. 
Turmeric, curcumin.com. Greetings, Devin. We're manufacturers of curcumin, 95% turmeric extract, plus piperine. And in the past month, two studies have been published on our product that have results you may be interested. Curcumin was able to reduce muscle pain. Did you ever get that? Muscle pain? Not anymore. No, why not? Lazy. No pain? Nah. <sighs> muscle pain intensity and decrease pro-inflammatory cytokine activity. You got any of that going on? <laughs> I don't even know what that is. It's bad, man. Yeah. You get that, you're, you're gonna die. Uh, we recommend that curcumin be used in individuals who engage in physical activities that result in muscle damage and inflammation. Okay, well, that sounds fair enough to me. The results shows the capacity of curcumin with pepperin to modulate an inflammatory response acutely induced by exercise. Exercise. Supplementation with curcumin and piperine was able to inhibit the inflammatory response after exercising and fatigue. Destroy Levon sincerely. The entire team at turmeric slash. Is that what it is? This is a slash, right? Dash. Is it a dash? That's a dash. I think that's a slash. Right. Okay. Turmeric dash curcumin dot com. Hey, I appreciate that, guys. And seeing as if, seeing as though I've you know been exercising so hard, yeah, I should probably get some of me. Immediately post workout. Why not? It says take one. I should probably take more. They just say that in the bottle. They're yeah, like, take one. Doesn't mean anything. You're supposed to take ten. I think. You want to make the bottle last. I'll take one just to start, yeah. but I'll take ten to ramp up. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, awesome. You want some? Yeah, no, I'm good. Are you sure? Save it for the one. Well, I don't need it. You need it. Okay. Okay. All right. What do we got? From unknown. From unknown. Who knows who this is from? Ultimate Warrior socks. Nice. <laughs> yeah, check those out, man. Check them out. Open them up. Super cool, eh? <laughs> oh my god. But it doesn't say who it's from. Wow. Yeah, but it doesn't say who it's from. You know what? I'll wear those in the match. Yes. I'm gonna wear those socks when I pull them on for sure. My green shoes and those socks. Wow. Yeah. Oh, that'll be that's the first time I wear. Pretty much. Oh, that's awesome. Super kick ass. Super kick ass. You can't lose. I won't lose now. Not with these socks on. Levon, you see this? He doesn't have those. He got nothing. What do you got? What do you, what do you got? White socks? Black socks? <laughs> Loser. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, don't bring me over this. Well, you said that earlier. You said it before when the camera wasn't around. You were talking about how much of a loser he was, remember? No, I don't remember. there on the couch. No, I wasn't. Yeah, you said it. Whoever that was, thank you. Super cool. I'll wear them in the match for sure. Okay. Um, online, online store. Squarespace. I think this is from Jim Redfern. Care of Let's Go Devin Larratt. I th I, okay, so I think this is Jim Redfern. Did um, you say that to move on to his face? What? Would I say what? Is a loser? Well, I think I said worse. Oh, on camera. I know, right? No, I'll probably I'll be very respectful when I see LeVon in person. Oh, oh LeVon. Here, let's do a rehearsal. Oh, LeVon. Oh, 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 LeVon. Oh, 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 yeah, I was thinking about that. Here we go. Let's get right to it. Been thinking a lot huh? about the rules. This again. Well, because I've said things. I was like, I said, you know, 
Like, if you don't agree to these rules, you're a pussy. You know, if you don't agree to the contract, you know. And then he started talking about fighting me and everything. And I was like, whoa, 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 you can't be fighting me. And I was like, wait, am I a pussy? Am I a pussy? I don't think so. I mean, should I want to fight him? Like, what would be the rules? Like, okay, so say, say we're having an arm wrestling match. You mean you and LeVon are doing it? No, you and me. Yeah. We're having an arm wrestling match. What degree are we allowed to touch each other? What do you mean touch each other? Like, like, am I allowed to? Oh, you mean like push you? Mm. Because I've been pushed in arm wrestling matches before, yeah. and it's been cool. Sure. Okay. So Why? You, well, I'm just curious. Where where are the lines? Like, are you allowed to? You're gonna push, push the line. Listen. Is he gonna push me? I just want to know. Maybe. I just want to know what the rules are so that we can both agree. Okay, we're allowed. You to won't lose. agree. What do you mean you won't agree? You haven't agreed so far. Well, we've gone off on the same rules. We well, because the rules were agreed upon. So now we have this new idea where I'm worried that I might be the pussy for not wanting to fight him. Right. So if he wants to fight me or push me or hit me. Yeah. Okay, like, so what are the rules? We Get paid to... first, then fight him. Well, I just want to know if, like, during the match, like, because I don't necessarily want the match to stop. No, you don't. Maybe right. a good way to wear him out. Tire well, I just want to know what we're allowed to do. Because if if he hits me, I just want to know. If, if he hits you, make him no match. Right. Okay. Anyways, we have to go over all this shit. Ooh, look at that! Look at that, Jim Redfern. That's some Captain Canada stuff going on. Ooh. Captain Canada. That's cool. <laughs> Captain Canuck. <laughs> Captain Canuck. Love it. Strong, very strong shirt. Very good. Love it, Jim. Love it. And I like that you got it in a three X because I'm so huge. Like two X is normally my size, but uh, I like my stuff a little bit baggy, and two uh, X is like not that baggy anymore. So yeah, three X. Let's. This has been awesome, but I feel like I should probably sweat a bit more anyways. So let's triple up. It's a good thing you got that black one first. Yeah. That would have been tougher to put on over top of this. Yeah, this is nice. Oh, yeah. You had two shirts on when you went against Ronda. Yeah, that's six. right. Yeah. Well, you I had one of them off. Or three. Yeah, because two? No, I had two. I had my high hooker shirt, I think, mm -hmm. started with. And like my whole plan was like, it's gonna be awesome. Like, uh, you know, you're gonna be in this crazy match. It's gonna be great. You're gonna you're gonna take your shirt off, and there's gonna be the Nike symbol, and we're gonna zoom in on it. And you're gonna get sponsored by Nike, and you're gonna you're gonna have a billion dollars. How'd that go? Nobody cared. <laughs> Nobody even noticed. I even sent the video to Nike, and they didn't even get right back. Like, yeah. Try it now. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. Oh. Thanks, Jim. Love it. Okay, what do we got here? Global value. Global value. Mm. Doesn't say who it's from. Oh, here we go. Brett Catlin from the UK. Ah, all right. You, you got some fans over there. Yep, UK is a nice place. UK, I'm, I'm going to come to the UK for sure. For sure, it's in my calendar. I want to get over there. Uh, even if I'm just going over to train and hang out. But uh, Neil's running a lot of good events. And uh, I got a lot of stuff in my calendar, but uh, if I get over, he's got a big one coming up, beginning of September, I think. If I can get over there sometime around that time, it'd be good. But either way, yeah. Gotta get, gotta get over there. Man.
Good job in the boxing. Yeah. Yeah. Customs wasn't getting into that. No. Nope. Not this time. Not this time. Okay. All right, Brett. Let's see what's up. And we got some arm wrestling handles. Which you can never have enough of. I'm guessing Brett is a handle designer. That's what I'm guessing. Ooh, look at this one. Yeah. It's a lot of reach. A lot of reach on that guy. A lot of reach. That's for a big hand right there. Yep. Ooh, I think he's got... I think he designs big hand stuff. That's what I'm guessing. I think this is custom for, like, big hand dudes. There's an envelope in here. I'll I'll do it kind of in reverse of the way I normally do it. Normally I read the letter, but since I've started opening stuff, I just oh I feel like I got stuff from you last time. I remember because I remember this paper. Yeah, this isn't my first time getting stuff from you. Yeah, I remember. You like that knife, don't you? Sure, yeah, somebody that gave it to me. I know. Yeah. I got that unboxing. Yeah, this is, uh, this is big wow. hand stuff. Look at this monster. Look at this monster of a handle. It's right right now. Oh, yeah, that's got, that feels good. That's got a good feel to it right now, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you. I'll tell you, that's got a nice feel to it. You think you can get some of that action on the lawn? Then? Oh. Cupping of the wrist? It'll be like, this will be the start. What do you call those things? Whirlwind? Sure. Yeah. So I'll, boom, and it'll. <laughs> really? And then, Right on the go. Something like that. Yeah. What do you think? Maybe. Maybe? Yeah. Man, aren't you supposed to just always say yes? Didn't that, that's what the guys online say. I know. <laughs> I aren't know. you supposed to always agree with me? Well, usually we disagree on everything in the video. Well, oh, it's not what they say on Facebook. Yeah, I know. Yeah, isn't, it, isn't, isn't that all true? Do you agree on that? Probably is. Isn't it like the gospel according to Arm Wrestling Uncensored? Yeah. Well, I don't know. I don't find that. <laughs> okay, the Arm Wrestling, uh, the gospel by, uh, by Arm Wrestling Discussion. Okay, if Arm Wrestling Discussion is a five, where is Arm Wrestling Uncensored? I don't even know. Come on. I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I hardly go on these. Okay, but before. Know. When you got up. And did you, like, did you, what do you mean you got off? Like, you, you never I never said I got off. You just said I got off. Okay, I thought you got off. Okay, so you. I don't know why. Well, I thought you said you didn't go on the page anymore. Right. Okay, so, well, so, you, so you know, is it, well, so. If, I'm aware of these sites. I just, I skimmed through them. I don't even know what the difference is between the two. So you couldn't give it just a number? Like, no, I couldn't give it a number. No. Oh, okay. I peruse Facebook. I like look at these sites. Center. Nice feel. Beautiful. Great tools, man. Dude, these are well these done, are fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, really, really nice. Oh, there's a letter in here I gotta get. Those I'll tell you right now. I, I can tell normally by a handle just, just by touching it. Mm. These are gonna be really good. They're gonna be very, very good handles. Okay, so you don't wanna play this game? What game? Our wrestling discussion is a five. Okay, it's a five. Well, just, I just say it's a five. I'm not, I don't know it's a five. Okay, so Arm Wrestling Uncensored is a... Five also. <laughs> Man, I don't know. Engen Terzi's page is a... Like a hundred. A hundred! Like, that's just because you're an Engen worshiper. Yeah. Yeah, I know you are. Well, he, he booted me off. Did he block and you? Yeah, I unfriended me. Did he block you? Uh, yes, I think he did block me. But I can still see his YouTube. I do watch on YouTube. If Engen Terzi yeah. is a five. Well, he's not a five. Okay, what is he? He's a hundred. 
Okay, if Angan Terzi is 100, uh -huh. out of what? 100. Are you, can you block him? No, I think he blocked me. Can you still give him 100? Okay, so Angan Terzi is 5. What's your... Well, I just want to know where people, like... So, if Angan, like, in terms of, like... You mean how much I like these people? No, in terms of, like, how much, like... How much do you get from it? Like, how much do you get from, like, reading, like... Like an Angan Terzi post? Mm, I don't get to read them, but I get to listen to them on YouTube. Okay. So that versus Grant Diaz. I don't know who that is. Okay, good. All right, useful tip. How to gain hand turning resistance using an arm wrestling strap with ergonomic hand grips. Insert strap through thumb hole. Well, that's interesting. That's interesting. So they're saying, You know, he sent two packages. I think that what happened is this package came late. Mm. And I opened his first package, like on the last unboxing. And then this one has come. And I think he's talking about like a handle that I got in the other package. Because this one has a pin that works with the old, with the other one. Anyways, so he's got one with a thumb hole. And uh, he works the strap through there, which I'll try. Looks cool. Um, all right. So let's open the other letter. Derek Smith is a giant. Okay. So we're not doing giant an influencer. Not doing an American thing. Oh, okay. I'm just saying it's for simplicity. I like Derek Smith. Yeah, me too. So, if Engen is five, I gotta say Derek's like higher than that. Yeah, Derek's as high as they come, that's what I say. Yeah, sure. I, I owe Derek a lot. Derek saved my ass big time. Oh. A couple times. Yeah, so. Did you tell him about that yet? Derek Smith. Uh, he knows I love him, yeah. Right, he Derek, does. Derek Smith. Yeah, Derek Smith, guys. Everybody, go and like, go and like Derek. Like his videos, subscribe to his stuff. Derek Smith. Okay, Devin Laird. Hi, hey Devin. I hope this package finds you and your wonderful family well. I was delighted to see that you received my last package. Okay, and I hope you are finding the training tools useful. I gathered from your comments that your favorite training tool of all is the multi spinner. I have therefore created a bespoke multi spinner with uh, and, and eccentric wrist wrench tool for you which i hope you will enjoy using also is an eccentric handle which is more specific to finger strength training videos of all these tools in use can be found on my web at www.arm what is that dash arm-max.com www.arm-max.com hopefully you can read that is on there? I don't know if you read this. No. No, let's just check this out. Yeah. Awesome. Devin Larratt. No limits. limits. As a creator, I'd really love to know what you think of the products and hope they are sized correctly. And this note reaches you before the match with LeVon. May I wish you good luck again. All the best for now, Brett Cowley. Yeah, buddy, I'll tell you right now, that multi-spinner is great. It's, it's, it's fantastic. It's great job. Um, this here, also, great job. I like how you've made uh, the part that uh, is spinning larger than the part you're holding onto. That's going to let you use a uh, lighter weight and really dial right in on where the pressure needs to be. So I know those handles right now. I know those two are going to be incredible. This one here, this one, I think is going to be a bit awkward for me. I'll tell you right now, I think it might be a bit awkward for me, just the way it's going to pry out my thumb. We'll see. Um, but I'll tell you, I know those two are going to be incredible. Thank you. Either way, thank you so much. Okay, two left. Let's go with this one. Hero Forge. Shape weights. 
shape waves. I don't know if that's a person or if that's a company. I'm not sure exactly. I have a multiple choice question. Yeah. So let's say referee Bill Collins yeah. says, Devin, uh, stop cheating. What are you talking about? Right. So you're jumping ahead. You you're jumping ahead. I know. The... So, A, would you stop cheating? Would you stop cheating? B, would you say, what are you talking about? Well, I certainly ask for clarification. C, would you say it's Levon who's cheating? Well, he probably is cheating. Or D, I guess I've already answered the mix of all the above. Here's what I will say. So much about refereeing um, and, and my reputation. I feel, that, and this is just the truth. It's just the truth. Everybody Here we go. blames me. Poor you. They blame me. And the truth is, is it's rarely actually me. I'm the one who wants to start the match fair grip. I just want a fair grip. No, you no. Listen, when I came to that table, everybody's like, why did you have a five? How could you let a five-minute setup start with John? You know what a rule is in arm wrestling? When you get a grip, do you know where the elbow has to be? On the pad. On the pad. Yeah. Can you go back and watch that match? Pretend, so this is me. Uh-huh. Okay, this is John Mazzink. Feels a bit exaggerated. And, and this is Bill Collins. Um, <laughs> Devin. Um, uh, Devin, um, bring your elbow to the back. And I'm like, his elbow's not on the pad. We're not even taking a grip. We're not supposed to take a grip when his elbow's on the pad. John, crying, whining, complaining. Be nice. Okay, all right, listen. John's the best. John's the greatest. Okay, but, but it's him. Get your elbow down, and I'll take the fair grip. I'm not gonna. I'm not just gonna give anybody their grip that they want. I'll fight for a fair grip. Yeah. Somebody wants to be. Right. Anyway, so I think you know that I'm not just gonna. If he's telling me to do something that I should do, I'll do it. Really? Uh, you will follow do. referee's direction. I always do. I always have. Oh, this is cool. A little figurine here. I wish I knew who this is from. Hero Forge. Custom miniatures. <laughs> hey, that's cool. Hammer. Can you guess, guess who that is, mate? I don't have my glasses on. Well, what's he got? Green shirt, backwards ball cap. Well, sometimes, right? Huh? Yeah. Got the hammer and the sword. I'm thinking it could be me. He's I think a, it is. A, fe a field of mushrooms. It's a nice touch. He's got gigantic arms. Could be. Could be. Could be. But don't break it. Huh? Just be gentle with the things, throwing it around. Thanks, Hero Forge. It's, uh, it's awesome. Yeah, I'll have to get on your website and check that out. Hero Forge. Custom miniatures. I guess you have to keep the hammer. Looks like I gotta keep it. Okay, what do we got here? I don't know who this is from. From, from Clapperton's Marine and Maple. Mike. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know. And, and Omnicron, fucking Demonicron, said he sent me something. So I don't know. I don't know if somehow I've missed it. Maybe this is him. Or maybe he sent me that thing. Marine. 
this is interesting. I found this old photo of your great grandfather. My great grandfather. Thought you might like to have it. <laughs> it's this guy. Nice. <laughs> of course it is. Of course it is. Yeah. Popeye eats spinach. Got in the <laughs> Drinks maple syrup. <laughs> I was like, great grandfather. Yeah, I didn't know what you were going to do there. I didn't even know my great grandfather. There he is. Yeah, that's him. Pumpkin. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Oh, I know what that is. Hello, Devin. My wife and I are newer fans. We have been watching you for about a year now. Love your awesome strength. Hope you enjoy the maple syrup, maple butter, and granulated maple sugar. Wow. They will help you get bigger. There's Exa no question. Exactly what I need. Mike and Sarah Clapperton, Clapperton's maple syrup. 2019 World Champions. Wow. Oh, my God. Yeah, and I did like the Popeye joke. That was great. Look at this. We are not messing around here, guys. Mike and Sarah, oh my god. Yeah, yeah. God, this is like a deadlift. Oh, oh. <laughs> Whoa. Look at that. How many liters is that? It's four liters. Wow. Okay. Okay. Yeah. How much maple syrup would it take to kill you? Like if you just started drinking. I don't think you could. You don't think it'd kill you? No. You think you just feel better and better? <laughs> oh yeah, of just course. Just stronger <laughs> and stronger and stronger. Exponentially, and yeah, yeah. Do you, you think someone's trying to kill you? Well, it's just somebody sends me four liters. Yeah. And I'm like wondering, like, like I would maybe drink it all before no, I got on the plane. No. no. Hey, you've already got a jug there. You're right. not even drinking all that. Well, what if I drank them both before I got on the plane? I think you're getting tired. A liter is a thousand grams. So there's probably, I guess, 4,000 calories or something, right? In a liter? So 16,000 calories maybe? I don't know. Because it's pretty much straight sugar, right? Okay, so 60 milliliters has 51 grams. Yeah, so it's pretty 53 carbs. Yeah, so on 60 mils, there's 53 grams of carbs. So it's, there's a little bit of water, but it's basically just all sugar. Yeah. Wow. Oh, my God. You know, I was going to diet after this match. Not now. No, now I'm just going to keep going, getting huger. You'll have to go Vitaly and Lebon back to back. Yeah, back to back. That's back the thing, right? Back to back. Got some uh, maple sugar. Hey, Joe. Look at this. Just look. You don't have to say. Wow. Uh, wow. Yeah. That's a lot. Look how big it is, Joe. You have to separate it into smaller containers so you don't rot it. It's already going to rot it. I mean, we're going to drink it all before you get on the plane. Amazing. Maple sugar. Hey, Joe. Maple syrup, you mean? What did no, I say? Oh, no, sugar. there's maple sugar, sugar here. Oh. And there's maple butter here. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Look how happy you are. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad you're giving wow. me such nice presents today. <laughs> happy birthday, Joe. <laughs> guys, guys, this has been an incredible... This has been Jody's birthday unboxing. Um, you know, love that you guys give to me is a direct transference to Jody anyway. Best birthday ever. So, yeah, probably Jody's best birthday that she could have ever, ever had. Through me. Yeah. She's laughing. Right, Jody? Yeah, for sure. Come on. <laughs> All right. Yeah? Good times, yeah? Yeah. Guys, thanks so much. Uh... I'll, uh, some of this stuff I'll, I'll throw in my bag when I'm, uh, getting on the plane tomorrow. Thanks for all your generosity. You guys are the best. And, of course, stay massive, everybody. Wow.